In this video, I'm going to show you a little bit about how associative dimensioning works in AutoCAD LT2009. Associative dimensioning means that when you create a dimension object, whether it's a linear dimension, an angular dimension, or any other kind, its extension lines are associated or attached to the objects that they're dimensioning. That means that when one of these objects moves, relocates, changes shape, or is otherwise modified, the dimension updates to show the new distance. Let me show you how it works. Let's say that I need to know the distance, or I need to display the distance between these two columns here in my floor plan. So I'll create a linear dimension from one midpoint to the next, and place the dimension. You can see that the current distance between these columns is nine foot three and a half inches. But what happens if I need to move one of these columns? Let's say I need to move this bottom column down. So I'll select the column, start the move command, and move it, say, one foot down. You can see that the dimension has automatically updated to show the new distance of ten foot three and a half. Well, what about the other column? What if I need to move it? No problem. I'll start the move command again, select my column. You'll notice I did not select the dimension, and move the column up, this time, let's say, six inches. Once again, I can see my new distance, 10 foot 9 and a half inches. So there you go, a quick example of how associative dimensioning can save you time working in AutoCAD LT.